question was related to a bit more, you know, looking into the future. Obviously, financial inclusion, democratized finance remains a challenge in Pakistan. The technology sector is booming, but off of a low base. And I was just curious to hear from you what you're thinking around these new economy areas are, particularly given our research here, both myself and Josh follow this sector closely, the emergence of Web3. Our analysis says that it's a $100 billion export opportunity for Pakistani talent in 20 years alone. Then this is just talent, right? Josh and his team have been looking at central bank digital currencies and the potential there. So what is your thinking in terms of enabling some of these new economy opportunities for Pakistan such that, yes, we deal with the crisis, but look five, ten years down the future and say we're investing in the new economy for the country? So let me just confess that I really don't know what Web3 is. It's, it's, so, so, I mean, you know, so... so yeah. <laughs> There's something in your mind. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so, that said, and, and, and that should tell you a little bit about where we would be five years later. <laughs> no, but, 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 and, and, and the Deputy Governor of State Bank, Murtaza, is sitting here, I invite him to, you know, chime in whenever he thinks he needs to. Uh, I don't really know so much about this. I know that uh, the fintech and new industry, you know, new technology companies in Pakistan have attracted a lot of money last year. And, and you're right, from a very low base. Uh, and, and we want to, you know, have them flourish as much as we can. Uh, I, I don't really know m much that we can do to help them. I know a lot we can do to harm them. So I think as long as the government stays away from them, that would help them. But, but, but seriously, I, I, there is a tendency in Pakistan that as soon as you see a business, you know, incipient business coming up, we'll start taxing them. So I, I'll remain, I'll resist that urge to tax them, but I'll let them, let them be and let them play their own game and, and hopefully they'll, they'll rise. Uh, and, uh, and, and keep the government away from them. That's, that's my short answer, but, but I really am not very, uh, educated on, 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 on fintech and, and all that stuff. If you want to add something, please go ahead. About the digital currency and all that, especially. 